Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I want to uh, install some parts I got from DDM Racing in the mail. I just got it in. Uh, sorry I haven't uploaded videos lately. I've just been a little busy with, um, been doing the boat stuff. I got, um, you know, you guys seen some of the videos on the boats. But I haven't uploaded in a few weeks just because, of course, I have family. Of course, I have other hobbies. Of course, I have other things going on in life and work and all this stuff. So, you know, it's, it's kind of hard to uh, upload all the time. But enough of that. Um, today, Saturday, I have a lot of free time. So, I just... Well, just something simple, nothing crazy. I just want to um, go ahead and install some parts, and I'll take you guys along the ride. And uh, be on the lookout also for more videos on my boat. So I just got something new, and I'm excited for you guys to see it. So that's going to be the next video. It's going to be an unboxing of, uh, of a new toy, uh, which is really fast. But that's next video. But right now, um, yeah, enjoy enjoy this video. Everybody's got their project going on. What are you working on there, baby? I'm going drawing and painting uh, my cornhole board. Ooh, that looks like a lot of fun. Yeah. Cool. I'm going to go work on my project, which is... Um, I got a whole bunch of stuff in the mail from DDM Racing. Well, not a whole bunch, but... Um, let's see here. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm curious to try this out. It's the uh, DDM air filter. So, um, I'm going to... I'm gonna put it on, install it today. I've been getting good reviews. Some people give it normal reviews. Some people give it bad reviews. But I kind of want to try it myself. I kind of like that it's blue. That's the that's the best part, <laughs> really. Uh, just how it looks. It looks nice. I think it'll mix with the the color of the shocks uh, on my uh, low C 5T. See right here. Uh, right there. You see, I like that. So I kind of want to match that. In fact, I might get a. Uh, that blue as well so um yeah <clears throat> so that's that i think i got some spark plugs in here too a couple of these i need some of these for my boats as well so i just got a whole bunch um another one of those return label just in case just kidding i'm not gonna return this i'll just keep it i'll buy another one too if i don't like this i'll get another one i think it's a little small it's like about a, an inch and a half. And then we got, uh, oh, the gas cap. Forgot about this one too. So this would be pretty fun to put on, but uh, this really doesn't improve any performance. It's not a performance uh, upgrade. It's just a looks upgrade, but that's okay. I like looks. And uh, another spark plug. And then this is what I was waiting for. This piece of candy is what I was really looking forward to in the mail. I mean, come on. DDM Racing, guys. Best right here. It, it just per, it, it makes your car go a lot faster when you eat this candy. You eat this candy, and it goes a lot, lot faster. All right? Just kidding. Okay. Take these guys out. Sorry guys, my house is really, really noisy. Including me, I'm like the noisiest one in my house. But everybody else, I guess, just follows suit. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Um, when I took the body off, I noticed that this barlow pipe came off of this here. So I gotta buy one of the buy a new one of these little rubbers, or not buy, just probably get get one from the Chris Chris's shop. But um, anyway, I want to put this. On here I'm noticing it's super small compared to this one so again it, it doesn't enhance the performance of the truck but it just makes it look nicer I think and um, I the foam that's inside of here I I think I might have to change it a lot of guys were saying that dust gets in there and um, in fact this stock filter is the one that's recommended but I might use this foam here. I don't know, I'll figure something out, put it in here, so let's install it. But the gas cap, I think that I'm gonna have to, um, I'm gonna have to put this little bubble thing in here because it doesn't have it, so. All right, let's get this going then. Should fit. Okay, so I think it does 
fit. Let's see here. Oh, look at this. Now that looks nice. Billet. This just looks nicer, I think. Like I said, it matches with this here. Yeah. Cool. And then, you get this guy here. I only have one hand here, so I'm gonna have to use my teeth. Here it is. And you can tell that foam looks a little um, cheap. So, um, yeah, it's gonna go here. All right. So let me um, set the camera down and install it. I might get a 990 carp as well, but for now, that's okay. So yeah, let me uh, set the phone down. Okay. I already opened it up. First impressions, look at this. Look at this. So I opened this. Immediately, you can tell this foam is like sucks, man. Look, what? Like, I definitely have to upgrade that foam. Otherwise, <coughs> anything will get sucked in there, go inside the carburetor and the engine and the cylinder. We don't want that. Um, look. What the heck? What is this? Look. Of course, we have to put a, um, a little oil on it, but uh, filter oil. Oh, shit. But, uh, yeah, I guess that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to uh, get a better, um, get a better sponge and put it in there. And, of course, I got to, like, put filter oil. But, uh, yeah, this is my, that's my first impression of uh, that thing. Don't want to return it, now. And then this guy here. I'm gonna put it on. Let's see here. I wonder if this thing comes off too. Yep, it does. Okay. There you go. Now we're talking. Okay. And then. There you go. Get it in there. All right, let's get this thing off. You know, on second thought, I I may just want to keep this, to be honest. Because um, I guess in this case, looks is not always uh, best here. I don't want to, at the end of the day, I, I don't want to mess up the engine. You know, I haven't really uh, taken this truck on um, a, a good dirt run. And when I do, I mean, of course, I know you can get outerwear, but, which normally I would get outerwear for this or any filter. Um, but um, I, I don't know, we'll see. If I can get the, the foam out of here and put it in this new one, in this new one here, then maybe. Um, I know Chris Bartolone has has a air filter out that's uh, highly recommended. So we might we might get that one. Okay, so take this guy out. So that was pretty nice. Look, close it and open it. That thing sucks so much air. Now, if I had a better carburetor, like a 990, it will allow a lot more air in there. So I think that's gonna be my next upgrade on here. But uh, yeah, let's continue to move this thing off. Okay. Take that little bad boy out. Take this little bad boy out. It's a nice day today anyway, nice day to run. So I think after this, let's spark it up. That right there. Mm. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, that's the entire carburetor. I'm gonna take that out. I think I just took the carburetor out too. So we gotta put that back on, obviously. And then just take this out. So that would be, let's see here. The second screw goes in there. Alright, so I think that's how you put it in there. But these screws seem to be a little bit on the long side. Uh, so maybe, maybe uh, I'll use the, uh, the stock screws that were in the older filter and then put it in there. But um, I'll screw it on and then see how it looks. And uh, yeah, I have a feeling I might have to use a, a smaller screw that goes in there. All right, looks like I got it in there nicely. It's tight. Got a gasket in between here and the uh, carburetor, and of course, a gasket between the carburetor and the actual uh, engine. So it fits pretty good. I already greased up. I already greased up these uh, these foams. So I think uh, what we do is we put this guy in there first, and then we. I could use a little bit more grease though, because I don't didn't really have any left. But at least I can uh, here and then we'll just tie it get it make it tight and we'll spark up the engine see how it sounds we're not gonna um, drive it anywhere because I, I'm just scared to put um, dust in the engine I need to figure out the foam situation uh, I might go back to stock or just get the Bartolone one we'll see uh, I haven't decided yet but at least we'll keep this on for now and uh, we'll run the truck let's run the truck right now and see how it uh, I guess looks and sounds and I believe uh, the airflow is going to be a little bit better in my opinion so 